guys welcome back to my channel so I haven't posted in a while because I'm having to film on my laptop in the meantime because my phone is like storage filling up so I can't film and so I'm going to be showing you what is underneath my dressing table today it's like more like in the boxes like yeah so this bag first thing it this bag so in here i've got some books which i've read these books and i've been putting them i'm putting them in this bag because like, i'm going to be giving them to someone because of from the older jack and wilson ones unless like i'm keeping them but that's that bag i'll just keep it under here for like storage so next is this uh, canvas uh, like picture so it's some uh, ballet shoes so i need to get that hung up but yeah also i am i'm also keeping um cards under here i'm not gonna show it in case i the watch but I'm also keeping like cards like under here like this is like come up where presents and cards more go like at this side so yeah and I'm a hoarder I don't like to get rid of stuff so I've got my box which my mug came in it's my Leo box and inside I had some toilet treats in this but like I don't like to get rid of it because it's got like nice spells on but yeah, I don't like to get rid of it because it's got like words on. I don't. Oh. Ah. So that's those under there, and then I've also got my fans box because I don't want to get rid of this either because like this is like come uh, the first ever fans box I've um, uh, had because I treated myself to the checkered fans. Um. It's nothing in but don't want to get rid of it because it's a nice box harder then i've got a carry bag and then we used me and my brother used when we were younger we used to always collect go-go's and like the stickers and i still keep the go-go's in this box this is a box my brother made when he was in primary school and it's got the ah hull city sticker on and it's a fairy box yeah and we just keep all our go-go's in here so if you don't know what go-go's are they're basically these like mini figures that stand up yeah sometimes i do still get them out and play with them because i'm a big kid at heart and then I've got some CDs because like I need some songs so I've got Frozen and a Barbie one but the songs are pretty nice good and then I've got my spare diffusers which I think that one up there is nearly empty so I'll probably have to um, open one of these soon this is the other one I got when I got that one which you would have seen on the post lockdown shopping haul and then this is one my brother's girlfriend got me Jen. and this is one my brother got the strawberries and cream one because like diffusers make your room smell nice and then I've got this box which has random stuff in so I've got marbles because I don't like to get rid because need something because if we had a power cut I could play marbles and then I've got um, my yeah, key ring I got when I was in year six so it's my middle town nurse school together we learn and then I've got this um, BBC like radio like thing we got that in school and then I've also got some dice in here because can never have too much dice 
And then I've also got some like wristbands. So some of these wristbands are like the ones that like came on like the glasses, like with, with McDonald's stuff. And then I've got a Royal British L Legion one, a 90 pop eats. And then Wakefield Walking World Cup. Another um, thing when it was like Team GP London 2012. And then I've got a Beat Bullying wristband which I got in school. Beat Bullying. Cyber Surf. And then Full Stop. And then an England one which I think the England ones used to be my brothers but I just keep them all in here now. And then there's another McDonald's one. And then I'm a One Direction fan, so I've got these um, One Direction like things. Don't really know what they are. And then I've got loads of key rings. So I've got like this one, which is like a hook thing. I've got a Bart Simpson. This heart thing which I think was on a bag I used to have so I don't have that bag anymore and um, this BASC I've also got some badgets in here so like badgets I used to like from like school so I was a humanities ambassador at school and then the head teachers award which is really good and then this one um, I think has a smiley face underneath but I put um, the sticker one we got from like a STEM week and then Aqualand got that in Spain obviously and then I've got some uh, like badges from like birthdays one I made like when we went up to the church like when I was younger we did like Christmas stuff and then this medal this is um from primary school because of like we did like stuff and these are the medals like got I can't remember what it was because long time ago primary school over 10 years and then I do still like high school musical as you can see so this is just like key rings I've got a Harry Potter badge, this green smiley badge. So this my box is basically um, key rings, badgets, dice, wristbands, like all sorts like that. It's like a keepsake box, like a memories. Because I never want to get rid of anything. So they just stay in there underneath. And then I've got my ring light box. So like if I maybe ever move them out or I need, so I need somewhere to put it. I can put it in here. It's quite big. <laughs> got a sock. Which missed my washing basket. And then this is my make up so I've also got like my makeup vanity up there so in in this summer makeup one which my grandma got me in this summer makeup uh, box um, I'm like keeping either the big stuff that doesn't fit in there or the spare stuff because I've got loads of lipstick and nail polish as you're about to find out so I don't know how it's really gonna open because it's on me but um, this is just the first layer. That is my nail polish. So it like more or less fills up the whole thing. This is like sample lipsticks. I've got more nail polish in the shelf underneath. Ah! With my bronzer and foundation. And then in this one I've got like mascara and eyeliner which I don't know which I don't know how to use eyeliner 
and then also eyeshadow and then underneath I've got like my Vaseline thing my nail art type book kit and then another thing and then I've also got like a big like eyeshadow palette with blusher in which also stays in the bottom because it's too big to even fit in there at all ah, and now I can't close it So it is quite awkward is this, I can't really show you properly because like, it will all fall out. It's more like spare stuff or big stuff. But then we come to the main box which you're probably all like wondering what's in here. So it's a One Direction box, of course, because one Direction is me. So take the lid off and this is basically what it is. So first up I've got a Magic 8 ball so I'm not really sure so uh, will I will I pass English this year? Uh, Will I pass English this year? So it doesn't really work very well. But yeah. And then I've got this like sausage. It's kind of a bit like bop it. But like you press it and it, you like stretch it, twist it, uh, poke it, shake it. And I think that's all you do with it. Still quite fun. Oh, and poke it, like, put the button. And then we've got this marble-like game, which is quite fun, but then gets quite frustrating. It's got, like, there's, like, one, two, and three. You start at the one, work your way. You can uh, go straight into the two, but if you fall off, you can skip one and go to two, or you can skip one and two and go to three. But three, but they're all hard because like you've got to like balance it so it doesn't like fall off so it's like a maze ball <laughs> and then i've got the and then in here also got foam blast slingshot not being open but me um have some fun uh, hitting my brother or my mum watch out mum <laughs> And then I've got two frisbees. We got rid of some of our frisbees, but I didn't want to get rid of these because I still want to keep some frisbees. And I think I used to use this one when I was younger as like a hat thing. Like, ooh, that actually looks quite nice. <laughs> so yeah. And then I've got Bop It. So they're both the same, green and yellow. So you've got Bop it, twist it, pull it, flick it, and then spin it. And then bop it, but I'm not going to press that because as soon as you press bop it, it starts. So, yeah, not pressing that because I'm not starting a game of bop it. And then I've got something here which is kind of like a magic trick. So, I put my finger in and it's basically going to cut my finger. Not my finger. So it's basically one of those like magic trick things, but yeah. And then I've got, this is some, a sunglasses case, but it's more like sunglasses I'm not probably really wearing as much now because... I've got my proper sunglasses which I'm wearing a lot more in which are from Avon in my grey drawers with boxers which will be in another video. These that I used to wear but the more probably kid ones now but still keeping them. And then I've got a pen. I did not know this was in here. Even if it works or not I don't want to get rid of it but it's going to go in my pencil pot. And then I've also got 
three glass cases in here. So I've got because anytime you get new glasses, you always get a new you always get a glasses case some with them a new wipe. So I think these are the ones some uh, think these are the ones that the, these are the very first ones I had with um, like the big like the lens bit bigger because the very first glasses I had were like small like rectangular like rectangular and then when I went on to these which I'm preferring these better now because it's like bigger gap to see through and they are dirty oh yeah good see if I can still see they uh can still see but they're very very weird I think I also picked these as well because they're pink my favorite color So, see, I've got a lot of glasses cases because I, I can't remember if I was in primary school when I first had glasses or if it was high school. Probably primary school, so, yeah. Because when we used to have a TV in our dining room, I used to move from this chair over we used to have, but I think it may have broken, and sit really close up. And I think that's what got me into glasses. Empty one. That one was loud. And then I've got a green one as well. And then I've got my two photo frames which I'm not getting rid of because like I like made them because these are like photo frames you make. I've got one of these but it's pink that I've got my dad's with a picture of Lassie in, my dog. And then this one is one like colour and this is the thing of that. But this is one you like colour inside like the right things. And then I've got when I used to have um, like a Nokia which had which wasn't a touch screen phone. That my grandma gave me this like phone case cloth thing. So got that. And then I'm really in whenever I get nano blocks, I'm really into them. Like you always get like they always give you like loads of spare like bits left so what we've ever done is we're only keeping one box and any of the spare bits or the books we keep ping in here because like in case like they maybe break so that's one of the ones and then one of the books don't, doesn't fit in though because it's a big one and it's the Titanic <laughs> which is always careful when we're cleaning on top of the bookcase because that's where it is and then when I was also younger I used to um, like doing these like things so it's like hammer so you like put like the beads in and then you iron it and then they're stuck together I used to really enjoy doing that and then something I got from holiday a bowl with um, a thing so you like attach it onto your waist and then you like whoa and then like try and catch it again so not really doing it properly now but you can. and that is everything in that box and then like kind of underneath I've got loads of stickers because if like we ever get back to normal and I get back to helping out at dancing if um like if I ever get back to normal and I get back to help out at dancing could give them stickers also a lunch bag and then my um spare oh heavy and then I've also got my spare dance stuff here which it's just loads of dance stuff so yeah that's everything more or less underneath my dressing table so make sure you subscribe if you haven't already like this video also turn on notifications so you know when I post because it could be random or it could be every Wednesday whatever so make sure you subscribe and I'll see you next time bye